kitchen. Hello, heads reality kitchen. Heads reality kitchen. Hello, heads reality kitchen. Reality kitchen. Delicious risotto. Reality kitchen. Reality kitchen. And as this is a reality kitchen, the first thing that we're going to have to do is wash up. Now that my minions have done their work, what we're going to have to do is get the ingredients from Safeway. All good. 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 Now, I said we're going to be cooking a risotto, specifically a vegetables with a little bacon risotto. And I'll show you the ingredients we're going to need. Cubes, of course, but I find this much more authentic way to cook food. Some parmesan cheese. Did I mention the chili? One red chili. Grated parmesan cheese, which is not actually for this recipe, but it's for when I make spaghetti. Um, and a red capsicum. Red, far more delicious, but also far more expensive than green. You must make the choice. We'll need an onion. Now this is a bag of onions, but that's all our ingredients for this recipe, or almost. We also have fresh garlic, cooking wine. This is wine. Cooking wine. Mm. Okay. Now what we're going to need for this recipe. Is this pan? Let me just give it a quick wipe. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Let us begin our preparations. The first thing we'll need to do is cut the onion. Now, we didn't prepare the onion earlier, so I'm going to have to do that right now with this. Now, the first thing you do when cutting onions, I find the most efficient way, is to cut the ends off and then run a little thing down like that. Did you see that? Now, a good thing to do while you're cooking, especially this risotto, is listen to music. The choice is yours naturally. And now we slice the onion. We have a nice sharp knife. You getting this? And so we slice away. You'll notice I'm doing this very quick, rapid movement here. Slice and slice and slice. There is half an onion. Okay. Now what we've uh, done here is we've got ourselves some butter and some garlic, and some onion, chopped it up. Uh, you saw that before, we chopped the rest of it. The uh, celery, the carrot, the, the little spicy extra bit, which is called chili, uh, a little bacon, and half, I decided we only needed half, of the capsicum. We also got some uh, mushrooms over here, and we've strained them out of the can, you remember? Alright, come on in. Now we're going to begin. Now what that means is I'm going to have to raise the lighter, no lighter. Okay. Matches. Oh, this is going to be easier. Uh, okay. Here's the lighter. Turn this on. You see that that's on? Turn it up. Make sure it doesn't burn while there's nothing in it. Now it can burn. Going around like that. Now we need a wooden spoon. A wooden spoon. Kind of. It's not really a spoon. And we'll use that. Butter. I think I may have put too much butter in, but I'm not sure. So I guess we'll find out. Lots of butter. High heat. 
Over here we've got the rice, we'll add it to stoon. Uh, bring all our vegetables over. Once this has melted a little, we're going to add our onion. You shall soon see. That is melting. Melting. As you can see, that is almost nearly uh, done. It's like it's doing as I speak. We're going to put the garlic in, get away, and the onion. And just for fun, we're going to add a little spice. Here's the chili going in right there. Okay, keep them over there. Now I'll quickly do a spin around. Should add a little olive oil. Just add a little oil. And here we are cooking the oil and the chili and the garlic. The, uh, you saw roughly how much. Stir that away. Now that'll soon be ready for the rice. So we'll put this much rice in here like this. That seems like a lot of rice. Okay, this is a little hot. I'm going to turn that down. Woo, that's a lot of rice. Now the next step, well that stays there, is we're going to get our stock. Remember our liquid real stock. Cut a little thing there. And we've got to add a cup of stock. It's a very easy process. You, know, you snip the corner and you pour it into this lovely cup here. And flow, 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 flow. There we go, this should do. We have a pot for the noodles. Now this should warm up very quickly indeed. We're going to have to light this. It's a little fun. That'll do. Now we'll need, say, that much. Okay, now this will heat while we begin our stir fry. We're going to put the lighter, here it is. We heat the pan. Sesame oil. Here it is. So we sprinkle a little of that in. Let that heat up a little. Oops. Let it heat up a little more. Maybe we'll put a little bit, a bit more in. There we go. Now that is on high heat now. Should be from the start. Alright, what we're going to do now is we have garlic, which has been uh, suitably aged. Uh, we've got some ginger, which is an essential ingredient. And we have some red chili. So we're going to add our garlic. Whoops! Little accident. Now we add our ginger, lots of ginger, and now the chili. Now we don't want that to burn before we put in a little soy sauce. Ah! Let's get the other soy sauce. Here it is. Throw that in. There's that lovely, ah, lovely smell coming out there. Mmm. Mmm. Let's add a little honey. Yeah, can you see that? Honey, yeah, honey. Oh, some wonderful aromas coming up out of this pot. Let's turn it down just a little. We're going to rush ourselves. Okay, and a good thing to have at this point is some rice wine. Now, uh, if you don't have rice wine, I suggest you uh, you can use dry sherry. Unfortunately, we don't have any dry sherry, so we're going to have to use some cask port. Turn that in. That's lovely. We'll turn it down a little more. And what we're going to do is add the onion. There we go. Finely sliced. Stir that in. Put the heat up again. That's looking pretty good. Turn it up just a little bit. Recheck the recipe. Now, of course, here's some chicken. I'll just send that in. Don't burn yourself. And we get it like that. And it goes. Lovely. Lovely. 
chicken. Okay. Hello? Yeah. Well, I'm in the middle of something. Uh huh. Okay. I have to take this. Uh, Luke, could you just come and stir that while I'm trying not to burn anything? What? What? Where did that happen? Oh, I left it in your hand. I don't care. No, no, shut up. I don't want to hear it. I see. Okay. Listen up. I want you to fix everything. I want the whole mess cleaned up right now. And if everything isn't the way it should be by the time I get there, I'm going to be very, very upset. Do you understand me? Do you understand? Right. Thanks, Luke. Kiss off. <laughs> Don't do that. Okay. All is not lost. Plenty of chicken left. As you can see. So. Now while the chicken is cooking, we're going to add some noodles. These are authentic Chinese noodles which we got from the Asian section of our supermarket. It's good uh, occasionally to crush them. Crush them like that. If you have trouble opening, some scissors is a good idea. One noodle, two noodles. Ah, oh. right. Let's turn the fork. Let's turn this down. Turn the fork. Stir that a bit. Having fun. This is high. This will cook. Cook a bit. While that's cooking, I'll just check the recipe again. Right. The next step is we're going to add the vegetables. Then I'll have to it. Just a little cooking pot. Right, now what we have to do is add the vegetables. Oops. Now you can see that we have carrot, celery, broccoli. The broccoli has been washed. Just basically chuck them all in at the same time. The like of that. Wasn't too hard, was it? Give that a bit of a stir. But you won't be hungry for the stir fry. Yeah, but. Well. Come on and have your ice cream. So now the problem with this dish at the moment is that we uh, need some more fluid. Now what I'm going to have to do, I think I'll just add a little bit more rice wine, dry sherry, cast pork, whatever you want to call it. Um, there we go. Yes, baby. We need more than that though, so we're gonna get like a cup. Just a water, water's fine. No problem there. Just add a little water. Yeah. 
Okay, then it stops cooking. Set it up. Now there's lots of fluid, that's good. Let's put a little bit more honey in. Use your judgment. And there we go. Uh, perhaps a little more soy sauce, superior soy. Good. And we're also going to add some sweet soy sauce, which I found in the cupboard. Give that a bit of a stir. There we go, that's starting, starting to come together. Give it a stir. And now. It is up. Good. Get that bloody smoke alarm out of here. Alright, well this looks to be virtually done. All we need now, I'll turn this as low as we can. This is already low. Let's get a bowl. Get some noodles out of here. Turn it off. Best turn it off while you're actually handling the food. This isn't the best way to get the noodles out. And they're a little bit wet. There we go. Lovely sloppy noodles. Turn this off. Like that. Now, you see that? It's ready when it's like that. Put on the noodles. Oops. <laughs> right, and now we'll just get some coriander. Sprinkle it over. Lovely stuff, coriander. And there it is. That's basically finished. Doesn't it look delicious? And now, we can celebrate. Yeah.